What's good in the hoodie gang? Oh, it's Papa Young. Welcome back to another mother freaking lit video. Today we are going to be putting on a another wig. I got my wig from Eula Hair. I think I'm saying it right. Eula Hair, ULA Hair. All their links will be in the description below. This is how the wig looks. Shinner and Shan Black Straight. I think it's 20 inches. I'm not sure. I can't remember. But y'all, look at this. When I tell y'all, this is so soft, silky. When I got it, I was like, hold eh, on. Already pre plucked, not bleached. Look at that. Giving very much scalpiana. Mm. So yeah, we finna be putting this lovely wig on. It is glueless. If you know, you don't want to use glue. We got the combs right here on the side. Got the comb in the back. A comb in the middle. So this bad boy ain't going nowhere. And it got the little strap in the back in there and shin. So we finna put this jank on. Um, this is probably gonna be a voiceover so I can listen to my music and do what it do. Heads up, I have some pimples on my face right now because you know it ain't your girl week this week. But that's okay, we're not gonna we're not gonna focus on that. We're gonna focus on this week, okay? So make sure y'all give this a like because I'm trying this again. It it, it is easier because it's glueless, but you never know. So, let's get it, let's go. Make sure y'all give this video a like. Comment down below if y'all do like these videos because your girl be struggling. And make sure y'all hit that subscribe button so you do not miss a post. When I tell y'all I was coming back, I am coming back. Let's get it, let's go. All right, y'all, so, you know, don't mind my be full heat, but this is how I braided my hair. I'm just gonna take the two braids and cross them in the back and use bobby pins to keep them down. Then we're gonna take our edge brush and we're gonna sleep them edges down, you know, shame, cause you don't want that, you don't want the glue. Well, even though we ain't using glue, you don't want that, that all up in your hair. So yeah. Now we're just slicking it back. Now we got our edges slicked back. We're going to put this wig cap on, you know, protect your hair. You know, be a, a bad baldy for a minute. I'm using Got To Be Styling Gel to hold the wig cap on. It's my first time actually using it. But, you know, wait till you see the results. And don't forget about your ear holes, man. You gotta have your ear holes to hold that cap down. Now, once that was tacky, I went ahead and put some Got To Be Glue spray on my wig cap so you know i can get some extra hold because usually when i put my cap on it's always lifting so we're gonna go the extra route put got to be glue styling gel and spray so that cap stays down So once that dried, I'm going to cut the extra cap off, you know, can't be capping out here in our shit. Now look closely at how that cap is laid down, baby. That was my first time ever laying my cap down like that. 
And for the back, I just went ahead and tied it. Do not mind the red spot right there. I was playing with the wig before I put it on. And I just kept, you know, putting the comb right there. And it just, you know, don't worry about it. It was okay. I'm fine. Now, as I showed y'all in the beginning, the combs and the strap for the wig. Right here, I'm just showing y'all how you put them in. They have different spots for different sizes. For me, I went ahead and put it on one of the smallest ones i don't want to say smallest ones just to make it tighter but here i'm about to just you know put a we on now for this next part i don't know if anyone else does this but i did i put the comb under the strap because my head is a little small and usually wigs are too big for my head so I went ahead and put the comb under the strap just so it can have an extra hold. these combs in boom baby there go the wiggy on look at the scalp giving very much scalpy on a baby no shin look at that now right here i'm cutting the lace to make it fit my head around my ears honestly if you really ask me i don't know which way to cut this so i just cut it from the front and then you see i went ahead and lifted it up and just cut the rest of the lace off i cannot get over it scalpy anna Scalpiana. Now right here, I'm not cutting the lace yet. I'm just cutting the extra off because it kept hitting me in my freaking eye. day because the, the day before i had to drop everything and go somewhere but we back to it so i'm going to use the got to be glue spray to hold down the wig even though it's glueless like i said the wigs be too big for my head so i gotta hold it down with something Now, the wig was pretty much straight already, but it did have flyaways, so I went ahead and strained it anyways. Ignore me right now, because it was my song. That was my song. So, I have seen this TikTok, right, where if you have flyaways, use a dryer sheet, and it'll take them away. And by my reaction, it mother freaking worked i was so shocked y'all it took down all of the tiny hairs if you made it this far into the video thank y'all so much make sure y'all give this video a like and make sure you keep watching for post notification shout outs at the end of the video because I will be doing them at the end of every video. But back to this video, 
Right here, I'm taking some Murray's Beeswax, rubbing it all the way through my hands first. And then I'm going to slick down the other little flyaways that I couldn't get with the, with the dry sheet and everything. Now that we did that, we're going to take the hot comb and just, you know, flatten the top out. Got to have a flat top with a wiggy on. Now that the Gatsubi spray is dried and my wiggy is laid on my head, I'm going to cut the rest of the lace off. Y'all, when I tell y'all, it kind of hurt. I was stabbing myself a little bit. But it's okay, though. I'll be good. Once we get all the lace cut off, this is the final results. Well, guys, that is going to be the end of this video. Make sure y'all give this video a like. Comment down below if y'all like these videos, because, like I said, I'll be struggling. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button so you do not miss a post because i'm coming back with more videos like i said eula hair's link will be down in the description you know a little some shum little shum shum you know i try little shum shum one through ten how i did down in the comments let me know um but that's the end of this video y'all i love y'all so much and i'll see y'all in the next video I want to address this comment right here from my last video. When I say bodies, I don't necessarily mean that I did it with every single one of them. If I put my mouth on you down there and you put your mouth on me down there, that's what I technically count as a body. So no, it was not three people in one year.